Hi Stampers, this is Marie Bennett at blackberriesandcream.net. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and today I'm going to show you very quickly how you can make a, a unique card using any stamp really that um, you want. A card that goes together very quickly. So I used two stamp sets. I used the Get Well Soup stamp set which uh, I was very happy to see is going to be carried over into the 2016 annual catalog. And I am using the I'm Always Here For You stamp out of Friendly Wishes. Some of the other products I'm using in making this card are uh, Smoky Slate cardstock, cut at 5.5 by 8.5, scored at 4 and a quarter down the middle a piece of uh, Smoky Slate Designer Series paper out of the Neutrals Designer Series paper stack. This is 12 by 12 paper and it has all of the neutral colors in it. And there are two, two designs well, four really, because one on the front of the page and one on the back, for each of the colors. So you have a dotted on one side with a, a written script, and then you have a floral print on one side with the diagonal stripes. And so I'm using the Smoky Slate floral print, and then I'm using a piece of window sheeting uh, that is cut at three by four inches. And I'm going to be embossing on this window sheeting. This really is what I wanted to show you in this video using Versamark and my Get Well Soon stamp. Just ink that up really good. And then I take the piece of window sheeting and try to get it on there really straight. Just give it a little bit of a tap so it'll stay tacky. And then I turn it over, gently press, because I, I don't want it to slide around, but I do want the Versamark, or yeah, the Versamark to give a good image on the window sheet. Pull it off and then I'm using the new copper embossing powder that's going to be available in the next annual catalog starting the first of June. Just sprinkle that copper embossing powder. I really like this copper and um, they ha they're going to have a lot of new products that go along with the copper in the next catalog. Okay, then I'm going to take my heat gun and um, heat emboss this image and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have uh, heat embossed the copper embossing powder on this window sheet. Uh, the reason I decided to do that on the clear window sheeting is because I love this designer series paper and it it always seems like we cover up most of uh, the pretty part of the card when we layer and so just this time I thought I would try it this way and I think this is a technique that you could use uh, with a lot of different stamps and get an entirely different look to your card so when I made the card I took some of those um, white accent dots and put one in every corner and then behind it is a glue dot and that's how I, how I attached it to the card. I hid the glue dots with these little white accent dots. Well, I hope you'll give a car, at least this technique a try using the window, window sheeting and the embossing powder and uh, make some cards of your own. I also wanted to show you um, 
one of the new in colors that's going to be available in the next catalog. Uh, this is called Emerald Envy and it's a really bright emerald green. I don't know how well the color is tra transferring uh, but it's a very nice color. And I tried embossing it on a piece of the, the new designer series paper called called Playful Palette and in person it's really cute but I'm not sure how it's coming across in the video and I'll show you some of the other prints in this paper sack. It's a 6x6 six six paper sack called Playful Palette and it has all of the new in color. So this is Sweet Sugar Plum and there's the Peekaboo Peach, Emerald Envy. Let's see what else is there? I don't think there's that dapper denim in here. No, Flirty Flamingo. This is Flirty Flamingo. No dapper denim. Sorry. <laughs> so that was just a quick idea for today. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you'll give it a try. Thanks for watching and happy stamping. Bye.